everyone this is maria i wanted to give you a sneak peek of alice she's finally done so this is more of a junk journal slash mini album i love the feel of it it's very 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 chunky vintagey exactly what i was going for okay let's take a quick sneak peek and i want to apologize up front if you hear my dogs barking in the background today is trash day and i think those guys are going to show up any minute all right so here we go here is the front cover and here's a little embellishment filled with pink sand it says drink me there's alice and she's holding her little key let me get that key out of there there you go she's getting ready to unlock the door handmade flowers embellishments from the cutouts some cheesecloth and then on the spine we have a charm some seam binding there is the alice title and then some alice in wonderland charms which will vary and then on the back we have one of the cutouts from the collection I use the chipboard pieces for this right here. Um, I purchased that pack separately. Um, but other, other than I, underneath there is just him, just flat. Um, I made this piece with the mold set. I have the molds with the teacups and the titles and all that. This is super cute, super easy to do. So the entire book is covered in fabric. And this is the tie. Let's take a look on the inside. So all the pages are covered in fabric, which gives it that chunky feel. And I covered the pages of fabric first and then laid all the paper on top. I know it looks like a lot, but it's really easy to put together. Okay, so here's a tag and we've got a little tie with a key on it. I hope you can see. Okay. And a little snippet here on the side stapled in. My favorite part is this page here. It is a shaker, I don't know if you can see that. There you go. Quick peek, pockets, we got tags in here. For journaling, I'll put the tags in later. I just wanted to show them to you. I don't want this video to be 15 minutes long. There's another one from the cutout. I have the stamp collection as well. So some of these pages have been stamped. A little tuck spot here. Little tuck spot here. This paper is just gorgeous. I've got like three packs of it. I'm still want to do some other things with this paper. Here's another page. And every single inch of this paper got used for something. I think I have maybe six inches left of it. I may need to make a little tag. This comes out. There's some more of that paper collection. That one is stuck on. No, that's a that's a tuck spot too. Okay. There's so much in here. Sometimes I forget what I put in here. Okay, these pages are windows, so you can open this up, open this door. You can pop a picture in there if you like. Stamp collection. This is the center of this little section here, and this little clock has little hands that move, except for that one. I actually glued that one down. <laughs> and a little 3D butterfly. I could have done a better job at stamping. I tried to stamp it after I had the page in there. Next time, we'll do it before. Another tag in here. I just love this paper. Another window. Cut out another stamp. And yes, like I said, I love junk journals. So I made a little snippet to go on this tag. This is just a little piece of fabric, some leftover lace, and I put a little Alice in Wonderland ticket that I printed. And this is the center of the book. It's a pop-up. 
it says it's always tea time and then this little piece comes up as well when you lay it flat only another one of those tags with the snippets and some printouts i love this oh my gosh it's so cute another window And these little arrows are Alice in Wonderland themed. So this one's like wrong way. One says this way, that way. Really cute. Another window here. A little flap. I guess you want to tuck something in there. I may have just enough paper to make another tag to put in there. There's this one. This is a tuck spot. There's another tag back here from the collection. There's Alice. Another tuck spot here. This is a little booklet for journaling. Let's put some paper in there. Okay, it's got open, butterfly. There weren't enough cards in the paper collection, so I do have these that I printed. They came out super cute and they matched the paper perfectly. Here's another tag with a little snippet on it. Another tag. This one's got a flower and a little clock at the bottom. I love this page. This has got a tag here and this little teapot. Pouring tea into the cup. I know I'm crazy. There you go. I love this one. Little tuck spot for another tag. 3D butterfly. Little glassy bag to put your trinkets in with a little clock on there. And that is it, ladies. I hope you like it and I hope you will join me in the class. This is going to be so much fun to put this book together. And there we have Alice. See you soon. Bye bye.